Hey guys. So it's been a while since I posted a video. Here we are. Um, brace yourself. This is quite the video. We have completed our bridge. It was a wild ride. Some points I thought some people were going to lose fingers. Some points I thought people were going to lose feet. And at some point I thought I was about to lose my Land Cruiser. But everyone has their fingers. Everyone has their toes. And I still have my Land Cruiser. It's all is good. Well, as I stood gazing at my bridge being completed, I realized that uh, our little adventure here in Belize has been quite the adventure and we're getting one step closer to having everything fall into place and to having our house built and being in my cozy forever home growing my food and taking care of my family properly. So I hope you enjoy the video. And remember to hit the subscribe button so you don't miss a single moment of my crazy life. And uh, I hope to inspire some of you. Now please remember, this may not be how you would do a bridge, but this is how we did it. And it's just here for you to watch. So comment, ask questions, um, anything you need. We'll try and help. And please subscribe. Please. Bye, guys. Yeah, just, just, we'll, we'll push this side in first. So we were originally going to dump a boatload of money into this bridge and build it with concrete and steel. However, we don't own this part of the road and it's not even anywhere near the house. So this part of the road here is actually a government road. However, right after it, there is no road, but there is a road. If that makes sense. If you were in Belize, you would understand. So we just decided to do it as cheaply as we could and hopefully because the wood is such high quality hardwood, we won't have to replace it for another five to 10 years, maybe longer. Stuck on bar. Jimmy's gonna have abs after this. Yeah. <laughs> Once Jimmy and Matt were done getting their workout in with the come along dragging five logs across, we put the deck boards down without nailing them in because we needed one more support log, which we had to get it from the back side of the bridge because we'd run out of hardwood on the other side. So we drove the land cruiser across, so we were able to drag the supporting log closer to the bridge. And then we were gonna slide the deck boards off so we could put the supporting beam in. Go <laughs> first. I totally jinxed it.
<laughs> Don't want to lug it all the way again? <laughs>